Good evening. The state television company Western Armenia represents the most important events of these days. Today is broadcast. Earthquake strikes Harbert province of Western Armenia. Mount Ararat is covered with snow. Nearest Gahan cookies are distributed in Ovajik province of Dersim. Turkish newspaper targets Armenian publishing house in Constantinople for books on genocide against Armenians. The symphony orchestra recorded the original orchestral works of Komitas. Earthquake strikes Harbert province of Western Armenia. According to the information received, the 4.9 magnitude earthquake, the epicenter, which is considered to be Harbert, Sivirchet district, was also felt in Malaysia. The earthquake caused cracks in some homes. Because of the panic in the district, the schools were closed for a day. The highest mountain in the Armenian highland Ayurat is almost completely covered with a layer of beautiful white snow. After the snowfall of December 27, the weather was sunny and suddenly a wonderful view was opened. From 2000 meters up to the summit, Mount Ayurat was covered with snow. Clouds on the summit of Mount Ayurat were shaped like a summit of a mountain. The Turkish media which fixed the scene described it as a bright sweat. The villagers in Ovajik province of Dersim celebrated their traditional holiday Gahan. Walking on snow-covered roads, they distribute small pieces of traditional Gahan to the villagers. The New Year's celebration called Galo Gahan continued despite the harsh winter conditions. Residents of the village of Ovajik prepared their cookies and walked to holy places, ignoring the hardships of winter. During their visits to the sanctuaries, they lit a symbolic fire, read prayers, and performed religious ceremonies. Galo Gahan begins on the third week of the December and can last until the first week of January. The children wake up in the morning and collect their gifts. They approach each house silently and wish happy Gahan. Then they represent performances, sing songs, and receive gifts. Gifts are mainly almonds, nuts, raisins, dried apricots, and etc. Amin Pazarchi, an analyst of Aksham newspaper, has targeted the Armenian publishing house Aras in Constantinople and the municipality of Chanakaya, district of the capital Ankara. The reason is that some time ago, a book exhibition organized in cooperation with Aras and Chanakaya municipality, which also featured books on genocide against Armenians. Pazarchi writes that the exhibition exposes the lives of West over the genocide they have been fighting against for years. The books of Aras publishing house, which is an Armenian organization, were displayed presented and sold there. They include 158 Turkish and 60 Armenian books. Rest the author paying special attention to French-Armenian author Michel Marianne book The Armenian Genocide. The State Symphony Orchestra of Armenia, under the direction of artistic director and principal conductor Sergei Sampadian, has recorded two of the original orchestral works of Komitas, Memory and Forest Night. The recordings are made by the Public Radio Recording Studio. The aforementioned works will be kept in Public Radio Gold Fund. The initiative of the State Symphony Orchestra of Armenia is dedicated to the 150th anniversary of Komitas. Now let us represent to your attention a song by Nubar. Official page of Western Armenia TV. This was all for today. Goodbye.